Sydney's new metro will be our country's most advanced railway, introducing technology never before seen in Australia. On the nation's biggest public transport project, innovation is a core value. Since 2014, our award-winning education program has taken more than 10,000 students behind the fence and inside a mega infrastructure project. In 2018, our innovative Metro Minds Challenge set the ultimate task. Come up with new ideas for Sydney Metro and our customers. As you know, STEAM stands for science, technology, engineering, art and Metro. Maths? I knew that. Maths. <laughs> we wanted creative, original and imaginative ideas from Year 9 and 10 students in the first Metro Mind STEAM Challenge. The Sydney Metro Minds competition is asking schools to put teams together to look at a problem that Sydney Metro might face in the future and find a solution to that problem using the STEAM class philosophy. Teams use the design thinking process to come up with innovative solutions to real life situations. We learnt a lot about engineering and how the process of creating a product works. We worked a lot on the presentation. So we learnt a lot about speaking and the engineering skills required to make a product of this size. I've really enjoyed coming to this event and working together as a team each and every day. The hardest part of this challenge, in my opinion, would be getting the prototypes together and working because it was a proof of technological concept and it's never been done before. It was hard to get it working, but after countless hours, it came together. They pitched their concepts to us on video, adding in designs or prototypes. We have solved this challenge by designing a new, more efficient train station using a new layout and our Opal Gateway. Every year in Australia, 20 million people miss the stops due to problems and distractions like hearing disabilities or phones. Our app will mainly benefit the tired businessmen and foreigners. As you can see, he is very lost. Metro Messenger connects you with people who speak your language and are locals. Greg also speaks Cantonese and has the Metro Messenger app and is happy to give up a few seconds of his time to help someone in need. And thanks to Metro Messenger, Steve is no longer lost and has finally found his way to his destination. Over 10 weeks, 33 teams of students from eight Sydney schools took on the challenge to come up with great innovations with real life applications for Australia's biggest public transport project. Six finalists showed off their innovations to a judging panel at the Metro Minds Grand Final. We had a room full of young people today that had ideas, they really wanted to share them and just watching that energy and seeing those people really wanting to promote a particular thing which had a direct benefit to us as an organisation was fantastic. I enjoyed this event because it was a very well organised. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity. I'd say the presentation was the best part. The thing that impressed me the most was the commitment and the effort that everybody had gone to to fulfil the challenge brief and particularly the wide thinking and the new ideas that they brought into consideration. The winning team from Northern Beaches Secondary College Manly Campus pitched two innovative opportunities aimed at customers. With the code names Project Falcon and Project Firefly, they used all aspects of STEAM, using technology to guide passengers to carriages with fewer people in them, and designing seats that descend from the ceiling to add seating capacity when trains are not as busy. We have named our solutions Project Falcon and Project Firefly. So what was a bit unique about my experience was um, I didn't get the opportunity to go to the school directly so we had a virtual conversation on Skype and the team that I was um, the ambassador for brilliantly they won today. Uh, they were really well advanced in what sort of ideas they were coming up with and they were asking lots of technical questions about the platform screen doors and things like that and being um, being there virtually is actually quite helpful for me because I meant I could go on my laptop and then get all the answers there and then which is quite useful. I think everyone's a winner on the day. Now it's time to get ready again. 
The 2019 Metro Mind STEAM Challenge launches in Term 1 for schools in Sydney City and South West areas. Students will complete the challenge in Term 2, so register your interest now.